What are the top tech careers that are shaping the digital landscape in 2024? In this video, we'll be talking about seven top careers that are shaping a digital landscape. If you have been confused about which tech career to choose in 2024, this video is for you. Stay tuned as we talk about some of the top tech careers in 2024. Number one is AI and machine learning engineer. AI and machine learning engineers are the architect of intelligent systems. They design algorithms that help machines to learn from data and make predictions from those data and use those data to perform or carry out some specific operations. AI and machine learning are currently in high demand as we are currently in the AI age. So it's very important if you're considering a career in tech, this can be a path you might want to consider. And it involves knowledge in mathematics and deep understanding of computer science algorithm. AI and machine learning engineers have a strong foundation of mathematics, statistics, and programming languages. The popular systems you see out there, ChatGPT and self-driving cars and some of these are developed by AI and machine learning engineers. So if you are looking at choosing a career, AI might be one of the career paths you want to choose. To acquire these skills, you need to take specialized courses or degrees in machine learning. There are a lot of academic institutions that offer courses in machine learning and AI or you can go online, you can check Coursera and some other platform that, is, that offer certificates in AI and machine learning. Number two is cyber security specialist. Cyber security threats have increased over the decades and now is the best time to acquire a skill in cyber security. A lot of companies out there are looking for cyber security specialists and what they do is they help protect our systems they defend our system against cyber threat to step into this role you need to gain expertise in network security cryptography ethical hacking and also keep up to date in latest cyber security updates and their defenses to acquire these skills you can prepare and get certified by some organizations and also some institutions that offer some of these courses. Number three is data scientists. Data scientists unravel the mysteries hidden in vast data sets. Data scientists use machine learning, static analysis, and data visualization to extract valuable insights from data. Data scientists are still very much in high demand in 2024. And I think this can be a good career to explore in 2024. So it made my top three tech career jobs in 2024. If you are new to this channel, I'm giving you an opportunity to subscribe to this channel and click on like button. Over 70% of people that watch my videos are not subscribed yet on my channel. Please subscribe to my channel. So without further ado, let us continue. Aspiring data scientists should master programming languages such as Python, R, and tools like TensorFlow, PyTorch, and some other tools out there. To acquire these skills, you can take a formal education or use online platforms like Kanga and um, DataCamp. Most of the roles I've mentioned are very much in high demand, and you should expect high salary. An average data scientist should expect about $90,000 to about $150,000 in the US. So you see that they are very much in high demand. But your salary can vary based on your region and your level. Number four is cloud engineer. Cloud engineers are the backbone of all the digital infrastructures that you see out there. Facebook, Microsoft, Google and all these tech companies have cloud engineers that help them manage their digital infrastructures. As a cloud engineer, you'll be working with platforms like AWS, Azure, GCP, and any other platform that offer cloud-based service. To become a cloud engineer, you can start by 
interning at a company that you know they offer cloud service and acquire certifications from some of these platforms like AWS, GCP, and Azure, and any other platform. And it will also make sense if you work on projects and use the knowledge from these applications in those projects. And you can start by interning. Interning gives an open doors to some other big arrows. So if you're considering a tech career in 2024, cloud engineering can be one of the tech career you may want to consider. To become a better cloud engineer, I always tell people that experience in computer networking will help you a lot. Because basically, what do you think they do? So in most cases, they help companies manage their cloud platforms. Ideally, some of these infrastructures are on premises. So they have you have a company that have their servers and computers and all their information on premise. Like, like that means in the company, like physical devices in the company. So now that companies are moving to cloud infrastructures, all those servers and all those things you see that are being managed on premises. So all those platforms that are on premises are moved to a cloud platform. All those things they have to manage physically, manage um, the routers and the switches and, and, and the addicts and all of that. They undo all those processes to um, cloud providers. Understanding about computer networks can help you a lot in this role. Number five is web developers. Web developers are still very much in high demand. A lot of companies still need someone to help them build the online platform and solve a lot of online problems. So mostly web developers work with some of these other roles that have highlighted. To become a web developer, you need to learn skills like HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and that's for front-end. For back-end, you need to learn skills like Java, C Sharp, um, and learn frameworks like um, React for front-end, Angular, and some other frameworks for back-end like um, Spring, ESP.NET, and so many other frameworks out there. To acquire these skills, you can take some online courses from Udemy, from Coursera, or use some free resources from um, Free Bootcamp, and so many other resources out there are free. And you can also take a formal education. I started in tech as a web developer, and it has helped me a lot. One of the interesting things about web development is that you can either build product for yourself or build product for community or people around you. And you can even ask businesses if they need a website, you can start from there. Depending on your career goals, you can then become a web developer for companies. And you can also acquire software engineering skills to even become better and build softwares for systems. You should also expect high salaries for web development roles because they are still in very much high demand. So in the US, for example, an average web developer should expect about $100,000 to about $150,000. That's an average web developer. So like I said, the salary can vary based on your region, the company you're working for, and your level. If you are new to this channel, I'm giving you an opportunity to subscribe to this channel and click on like button. Over 70% of people that watch my videos are not subscribed yet on my channel. Please subscribe to my channel. So without further ado, let us continue. Number six is DevOps engineer. A DevOps engineer and a cloud engineer, they, they look very similar, but their work is a bit different. DevOps engineer plays a huge role in software development delivery. They help in automating, managing, and fostering collaboration in software engineering team. Learning about tools like Docker, Jenkins, and mastering scripting languages like Batch and PowerShell is very important for this role. You can acquire some of these skills from Udemy, Udacity, Coursera, or getting certification from DevOps Institute are also very important for this role. You can also start your career from this role by taking an internship and your career can progress easily from there. Number seven is product designers. 
Product designers shape the way we interact with technology. They create user-friendly interface for most of the applications we have out there. In fact, I believe in the future when we have a lot of AI roles, product designers will still be very much used to because most of this process will most likely be automated in the future, but we need humans to design what the user interface of most of these projects or products will look like. UI UX product designers, they are still very much in high demand in 2024. Skills that are very important for this role include understanding user psychology and mastering tools like Figma, Sketch, and Adobe SD, or many other tools that are available for product designers is very important for this role. To acquire these skills, online platforms like Coursera, Udemy have a lot of courses that can help you acquire most of these skills. And taking a formal education can also be very helpful for this particular career. That is my top seven tech careers that will shape the tech landscape in 2024. There are so many others, but I decided to just stick with seven that are very important. There are so many tech careers that will shape our digital landscape in 2024. These are my top seven tech careers that will help shape our digital landscape in 2024. So if you are looking at switching, switching careers or acquiring skills in tech, you might want to consider some of these rules. Thank you for staying to the end of this video. If you are not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. And I'll be dropping some of links to some of my vid old videos here. Please take a look at them and drop comments, or ask questions. I'll be willing to answer some of the, your questions. Thank you very much and I'll see you on the next one.